The Biden administration declared monkeypox a public health emergency today as it rushes to stop the virus's spread. So what does the declaration mean for the tri-state area? Eyewitness News anchor Siafa Lewis spoke with local health care leaders on the help they hope to receive from the federal government. Siafa, good evening. Good evening, Yuki. Your question about what the federal declaration means to us here in the Delaware Valley is exactly what we tried to find out this evening. And as is so often the case, it all starts with money. It could free up um, funding to help support the response. We're hoping it might help to, to get more vaccine faster than we would otherwise get it. So I think it's an important step. I'm hopeful that it will start to expedite some of the resources that we need locally. Philadelphia currently has 82 cases of the virus. Camden County in New Jersey has six, and the entire state of Delaware also has six. That said, if COVID-19 taught us anything, those numbers could easily and quickly skyrocket. To prevent that issue, vaccines are needed, and they are currently in short supply. We do have vaccine available for individuals that are at high risk, but to have a level of vaccine that we could get out to the community um, at a, on a larger scale, we don't have that at this time. And so our local health departments are stressing mitigation efforts, being mindful of your contacts and behavior, which right now centers on gay and bisexual men. There's nothing about monkeypox that, other than it having started in that community um, and spreading in that social network right now, there is nothing that would make it not spread in other social networks. Now, with the school year just weeks away, the Camden County Health Department plans to meet with school superintendents to discuss what to look for in possible monkeypox cases. And while no local health department is ready to issue a health emergency, they do, as you heard, hope for funding and vaccines, and they need us all to remain vigilant. In Spring Garden, Siafa Lewis, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Yuki, back to you. Siafa, thank you. If you have questions about monkeypox, including who is eligible for a vaccine and where to find one, go to CBSPhilly.com.